Hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy this story. I'm going to try and upload a new story each day. The Curse Camera In the quiet town of Ravens Hollow, renowned photographer Amelia Hardy received an unexpected inheritance from her estranged grandfather, a mysterious man with a reputation for dabbling in the occult. The inheritance, however, wasn't a dusty old mansion or a hidden fortune, but a seemingly ordinary camera. Little did Amelia know that this camera held an unsettling secret the ability to capture the future. Initially intrigued by the vintage device, Amelia tested its capabilities taking snapshots of random scenes in her life. To her disbelief, the developed photographs unveiled unsettling images of tragic events that hadn't occurred yet. Each picture depicted a horrifying glimpse into the future car crash, a burning building, and even a funeral with mourners she couldn't recognize. Determined to understand the true power of the camera, Amelia delved into her grandfather's journals, discovering a cryptic connection between the cursed device and a long-lost family curse. According to the writings, the camera had been passed down through generations, leaving a trail of misery in its wake. The curse dictated that whoever possessed the camera would be bound to alter the course of destiny, facing the impending horrors captured by its lens. As Amelia grappled with the weight of her newfound responsibility, she noticed a recurring figure in the photographs a sinister, shadowy figure lurking in the background. This mysterious presence seemed to feed off the impending tragedies, becoming more pronounced with each new photograph. Terrified yet determined, Amelia embarked on a perilous journey to alter the fates revealed by the cursed camera. Her first task led her to a quaint cafe where a seemingly innocent gathering turned into chaos. With the camera in hand, she desperately attempted to warn the unsuspecting patrons, only to be met with skepticism and disbelief. Undeterred, Amelia took it upon herself to prevent the tragic event. As she intervened, the shadowy figure grew stronger, manifesting itself in the physical world, a dark omen of the chaos that threatened to engulf Raven's Hollow. The town, now gripped by fear and paranoia, shunned Amelia as the bringer of misfortune. Undeterred, she pressed on, determined to break the cycle of the cursed camera. Each photograph became a race against time as she encountered new challenges and mysterious illness, a series of unexplained accidents, and even a malevolent spirit haunt in the town's forgotten graveyard. Amelia's journey took her to the heart of the curse's origin, a long forgotten ritual site hidden deep in the woods. There, she faced a choice that would determine the fate of Raven's Hollow to break the curse and free the town from its sinister grip or succumb to the malevolent force that sought to manipulate destiny for its own dark purposes. As the final confrontation unfolded, Amelia found herself battling not only the supernatural forces but also her own fears and doubts. The shadowy figure, now a menacing entity, taunted her with visions of the town's impending doom. In a desperate bid for redemption, Amelia harnessed the camera's power one last time, capturing an image that defied the dark prophecy. The world around her trembled as the curse shattered, releasing Raven's hollow from its malevolent grip. The shadowy figure dissipated, leaving behind a lingering sense of dread. As the town slowly recovered, Amelia, now haunted by the memories of her harrowing journey, decided to seal the cursed camera away, vowing to protect future generations from its ominous power. The once quiet town of Raven's Hollow would forever bear the scars of the cursed camera, a cautionary tale of the thin line between fate and free will. Amelia, now a reluctant guardian of the supernatural, vanished into the shadows, leaving behind only whispers of the photographer who dared to alter destiny. Little did she know that the camera's curse had not been fully extinguished, and somewhere, in the hidden corners of the world, a new inheritor would soon uncover its malevolent secrets. Years passed, and Raven's Hollow began to heal from the wounds inflicted by the curse camera. The townspeople, though still haunted by the memories of that dark period, gradually returned to their normal lives. However, the legacy of the camera lingered in a collective consciousness, a cautionary tale shared in hushed tones. Amelia, having kept her promise to safeguard the cursed camera, lived a reclusive life on the outskirts of town. The weight of her experiences had aged her beyond her years, and the once vibrant photographer now bore the marks of a battle-worn warrior. Yet the shadows of the supernatural continued to whisper to her, reminding her that the malevolent force might still be at play. One stormy night, 
as lightning streaked across the sky and thunder echoed through the hollow, a knock echoed on Amelia's door. Cautiously, she opened it to find a disheveled man, his eyes wide with desperation. He introduced himself as Samuel, a historian with a keen interest in the occult. Samuel claimed to have uncovered the dark history of the cursed camera and sought Amelia's guidance in putting an end to the curse once and for all. Reluctantly, Amelia agreed to share her knowledge, realizing that the camera's malevolence had not been confined to Raven's Hollow alone. Samuel, armed with newfound information, expressed his determination to destroy the cursed artifact and prevent its insidious influence from spreading further. The duo embarked on a perilous journey, tracing the camera's twisted lineage through forgotten rituals, ancient texts, and hidden archives. As they uncovered the sinister machinations behind the curse, they also encountered manifestations of the shadowy figure that had tormented Amelia years before. The malevolent force, it seemed, had grown stronger, adapting to the changing times and finding new ways to sow chaos. Their pursuit led them to a desolate mansion at the edge of a forsaken forest, a place where the camera's curse had first taken root. Within its decaying walls, they faced supernatural challenges, puzzles that tested not only their intellect but also their resilience in the face of the growing darkness. As they reached the heart of the mansion, they discovered a chamber adorned with eerie symbols and surrounded by the chilling air of malevolence. In the center stood a pedestal upon which rested the cursed camera, seemingly pulsating with an otherworldly energy. The shadowy figure materialized before them, a twisted reflection of the darkness that sought to maintain its hold on destiny. In a climactic confrontation, Samuel and Amelia waged a battle against the malevolent force, each drawing upon their own strengths to resist its manipulations. As the struggle reached its zenith, Samuel made a self-sacrificial choice offering himself as a conduit to absorb the dark energy emanating from the cursed camera. The room trembled, and the shadowy figure convulsed in agony as the curse's power was redirected. In a blinding flash, the cursed camera disintegrated, and the malevolent force now severed from its source dissipated into nothingness. The mansion, once a haven for darkness, began to crumble, its supernatural essence fading away. As the dust settled, Amelia stood alone amidst the ruins, her eyes reflecting the toll of a lifetime battle in the supernatural. Samuel's sacrifice had broken the curse, but the scars of their journey remained etched in her memory. With a heavy heart, she left the forsaken mansion, the shadows of the past trailing behind her like ghostly echoes. The cursed camera, now reduced to ashes, marked the end of a dark chapter. Yet, as Amelia looked to the horizon, she couldn't shake the feeling that the forces they had faced were not entirely eradicated. The supernatural world, she realized, was an ever-shifting tapestry of light and darkness, and as long as there were those who dared to peer into the unknown, the echoes of the cursed camera would continue to linger, awaiting their next unwitting victim. Thank you for listening, I hope you enjoyed this story. Please don't forget to like and even better like and subscribe. Thank you very much and I hope you have had or have a great day.